Greetings. These messages are for your entertainment. Take what applies, leave what is not for you. All of your support is abundantly appreciated. Still, thanks for liking the video. It means so much. Sharing, commenting, subscribing. Let's get into it. So, there's someone that is like so so into taking from you it's like an obsession at this point and they don't care they're brawling with it they've gotten so used to it and they try to do it behind your back but at this point they don't care so this person is thinking around and uh, doing something like taking something that would have been for you but at this point it just at first they were hiding it and being really sneaky they still are at first they were they were like making up stories they they were guilty about it but now this person they just don't care they're just they're gravelly gr they're greedy they're gluttonous they're just into it they could be desperate so I don't know what sources that this person is getting something that belongs to you from. What is this source? It could be a person. It could be an institution. This person, they go every now and then and get this thing. And there's some, you have like some inclination about what is going on. Yeah. I don't know what they're using this to do. Maybe um, to buy things for their skin, beauty products. I don't know how this started, right? That's the energy you are in. You don't know how it started. You don't know um, what is really going on. But you have some kind of an awareness that this is going on. No, someone is getting tired of it. Someone is getting tired of being taken for granted so the person that the person or the institution something like pilfering the person or the institution that is being used is getting like upset they are about to call you or because your name may be on the documents or something suspicious is going on where someone wants to i hear idly so this could be something that you haven't looked into in a while. And it has something to do with your life. It's like the, your insurance of self. When wh when was the last time you checked out your insure, your Like whose life is your hands in? Is it in your own hands? Who is benefiting off of your life force energy? You know? So someone wants to call you. Because something is getting out of hand or it is suspicious or it, it's getting excessive. So you're about to be made known some truth. For some of you, you know what is going on and who I am talking about and you are going to be the one making that call to someone to make some checks. It's like they're using your money or your energy, your resources to eat food and to beautify themselves. This could be people talking about you just using your name and just benefiting off of your energy. You are going to get information about this. Yeah. And this could be two individuals that's been doing this. Two of them. They do it in the dark, isolation. They're doing it at night. They think that you don't know. They're, they're just trying to eat a food off of you or... It could be tiny amounts that they're getting off of you. But they're about to be found out. Insecurity. They're about to be found out because they're being watched. And you are protected. You have people on your side. These people were being looked into. They were being trailed and followed. Someone just needed to know where they were going to go. Discovery. And so these people were being followed. And they were being tracked and traced right down to the point of everything. It's like we're going to find out how they got your information. This is reminding me of how I met your mother. 
how they got your information how they got your name how they got your email address how they got your story how they got anything that how did they get your how did they get these things mysticism two of them and i don't think that they're wealthy to me they're not striking me as wealthy people creation but you never know it's just giving me the energy of they're making just some money from off of you like and then they're buying food with it and hurrying up and sitting in the dark and eating it like someone mm -hmm. okay grief but they're they were being followed by some divine spirits ex to exactly where their home is i'm getting and then they were being watched even inside of their home and they were they have been being watched for a while forgiveness because they were they were whoever was watching them was learning about whatever their operation was and who they were working with and these people they then go out on the road and they act so called normal yeah i'm telling you okay so you, so we see abundance for you fortune ace of pentacles wealth moving into your life and i also feel happiness in glorious abundance this is justice on the bottom of the deck this is your justice um you're gonna get like this is gonna come as a surprise to you too you are a bad you know what full of life love and possibilities and finding the best path right now the best things are happening for you yeah. two of swords Queen of Diamonds, you're, like your way is being made. Trust your instincts. Trust your gut instincts. There's something about your mother, something about rope, something about a Capricorn, jewelry, or someone feisty. Or you could be a mother. You're fertile. You're getting, look, you're getting your wealth back. Prayer. You're getting your wealth, your supreme abundance back. Right into the palm of your hands. And some thieving energies they're going to be removed everything is going to be made right the malicious energies are taken away from you people are going to go down i'm telling you i see perfection your energy is going to be left clean and clear and whatever obstacles you had are moved you're free your name is cleared everything you're exonerated everything you're living life beautifully, luxuriously, lovingly. You may relocate to somewhere up on a mountain where you're just living a beautiful, prosperous life with your garden, your plants, your money-making abilities, your intelligent mind, your prosperous, wealthy, healthy, vibrant mind, aura, spirit, energy, friends, relationships, writing books, sipping wine, you know, making food, maybe having children, maybe getting married, having a kingdom, self-sufficient, money pouring in like waterfalls. You've never lived so good before. But I'm getting with this bittersweet card. You had to find out some truth and let some people or some situations go. If you did not, you would not have regained your beauty, your liberation, your prominence, your success. You, the truth, the, the, and the, what your wealth was hidden in the lies. Your real true life was mingled up in the disillusions and the and the and the chaos down here about about who you were, who you come to find yourself to be. Once you have all of this cleared up and moved out of the way, you can see who you truly are and you choose you and life is choosing you. The heavens and the angels are choosing you and presenting you with your marvelous rewards. Joy. You've put it, this is your earnings. This is your blessing. This is your inheritance. This is what is in your field of um, manifestation. It's already always been there. This is what you've worked for. But then it's like, you innocently did not know what, what was stopping you. What was blocking you, right? But the truth come out and reveals everything. You could be an artist. You could be a superstar. You're getting superstar energy or superstar quality. Right? You're leveling up. You could be getting a bike. You're going to be you're going to be married to 
free, liber liberated. And the truth is setting you free. You're cutting ties. Okay? Yeah, the Six of Wands is the next card. I hear dancing. Someone said you out. This is reminding me of someone on TikTok. The Six of Wands energy. Very attractive and beautiful. But I'm getting someone sell someone out here. As I said that. Someone sell out someone about a, something about a beverage. A drink or a shot. Someone is finding out the truth that someone did not choose them. Someone is not for them. Someone is seeing that someone is just about the highlights and the lifestyle and the glamour the, and the fashion, the glitz and the glam and the pandemonium and the madness. What about what about the days when um, before this was a job and before I got paid? You know, someone is just, someone is just like, that's what I'm saying. Someone would just sell out for anything. Going back to the beginning that I was saying someone is doing something behind your back and they keep doing it and doing it because they, it's like they got obsessed with it and you were not aware. And this could have been affecting your reputation, affecting your name. Because someone, someone did not choose someone here. I'm getting insecurity. Someone is going through a lot though. The person that wasn't chosen or something. Someone that was selling someone out there going through a lot of insecurities. I hear blam them, you know. But they want to take it out on you. They want you to feel their pain too. Enlightenment. They wouldn't mind if you see them for real and know what they're going through. But at the same time, you, and it's like the angels need you to stand your ground as well. So that this person don't come through and manipulate you. That's not how you help someone, you know. You help them by being truthful and being brave in yourself. So that they can see that you love them for who you know who they are, not who they're showing you to be, or something like that. You're taking yourself back, perfection. I feel like you're choosing you, Aries energy. Yeah, nine of wands, no, six of wands, nine of wands. Because there was some bitter competition. You could have been getting some opportunities to move, to move up, to relocate, to travel. To maybe work, collaborate with another person, bittersweet. And you, I feel like you're just learning some truth that is setting you free. You're feeling glorious and joyful. You could be working with galactic people or something futuristic that is going to make, like it's going to make your future feel feel set with abundance. This is going to set you up in the future. Whatever investment this is that you're making. And you're getting a lot of attention for it. A lot of eyes are on you. Five of wands. Yeah. Seven of, seven of wands. No. Five, five of diamonds. And this is seven of wands. I mean seven of wands. Yep. Someone was trying to even make a mockery. Three of swords. Wow, white youth. Three of swords. Someone was trying to make a mockery. So five of diamonds, seven of wands, three of swords. You've been through a lot dissipating. Someone trying to defame someone. Someone trying to steal your place. Someone trying to um, discredit you. Someone having affairs, like I was saying. And then we have the lover's card. Something was toxic. But you are overcoming it. I feel you're overriding this. You're overcoming it. You're going to overcome, overcome this in many different ways, shapes and form. Financially, emotionally, spiritually. The hardest may be for you emotionally or spiritually. Because this is someone that you bonded with and trusted with. Trusted and loved. Or some situation or some group or company. Alright. Um, this could be about music. But you're going to overcome it. You're going to rise above these challenges. And succeed. You're getting more. You know. You're learning more. And you're proving to be. 
a warrior, a fighter, a person that sees through, a person that is a way maker, a person that is a leader, and you're not going to be stopped. Someone can, uh, someone or an energy wanted you to stop chasing your dreams. Wanted you to say, okay, here's the obstacle. Back down now. Ha ha. An obstacle told you and you would have believed it except you were like, maybe I can get through this. So you challenged yourself and you outdo and you are moving into like this beautiful life of abundance and love and beautiful connections with high vibrations i did say something about the galactics like this is my alien card justice all right so take it easy much love to you all is well and all is within you take care